welcome back to Monday. To Monday today. Welcome we're back to that. Monday. Stay at Home Tennis Season 2, Episode 7. I was going to say 412. Tennis Awakens. Um, <laughs> so for today, you're actually only going to require tennis balls. You will require up to four and a partner. Yes, that is very, very important. Without further ado, on to the red stage. For the red stage, we've got two players and two balls, one ball each. What you're going to do is hold the ball out to our left-hand side, we're going to do it to our left. We're going to throw the ball a little throw up in the air, and then we're going to change places to catch after one bounce, like this. Catch, back behind the line, out to the left, and throw, catch. Going, catch, you're trying to keep that ball near the line, so the other player has to move across to catch. Voila, it looks like this. Okay, now you know what the challenge is, we're going to see if we can do that for 30 seconds without any mistakes. Joe's going to get the timer ready. The timer is ready. Three, two, Hold it out one. Hold to the left side, go. and let's go. Okay, I'll do some counting. Scott, can do some talking? Counting? Counting, counting, how many mistakes? <laughs> I was thinking. Expecting zero. Absolutely. That's it. Always throwing it out to your left, okay, so that you don't collide with one another. And then throw it up to probably about eye level, so you've got plenty of time to get across and catch that ball. If you want to make this a little bit more tricky, if you've got a bit more space at home, you could stand further away. That'll make the other player have to run a little bit more together. There That's we time. go! Zero mistakes. Boom! Okay, on to the orange stage. Again, we're working in pairs and we need a tennis ball each. We are going to stand opposite each other holding the tennis ball out to our left, but we're not running forwards this time to catch the other person's ball, we're going out to the side. So we're going to throw the ball up to the side and then catch the other person's tennis ball. Okay, so throw it up. Okay, so the type of footwork you're doing are side steps. So we're going throw, side step, catch, throw, side step, catch, throw, side step, catch. And again, we're going to see if we can do that for 30 seconds without any mistakes. Okay? So, I've got the timer here. Are you ready, Joe? I'm ready. On your marks. Get set. <laughs> Go! That's it. Let's see if we can do it without any mistakes. Because you're going to have fast feet. If you find it easy, you can always drop the ball a little bit lower. So you're not even throwing the ball up. And you can really speed it up. I'm going to bump into everything in my living room today. <laughs> I've hit a chair, I've hit the piano. That's it. This is a really good exercise to actually warm up with because it really gets your feet moving. Yeah, I feel like I'm using my thighs quite a bit here as well. This is a long 30 seconds. There we go. There we go. <laughs> right, let us know how you did in the comments below. Green is Joe's favourite colour. I mean, actually, it is my favourite colour, but it's also the stage that we're going to oh do right Lord. now. Oh my gosh. Incredible. Um, so what you're going to need is a partner, again, and you're going to need two balls, one each. So what we're going to do is we're going to stand about yay far apart, yay far. about yay far apart, and we're going to do a bit of juggle tennis. It's a different juggle tennis what you might have done at the tennis club. Yeah. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw with my right, catch with my left, and then transfer across. Okay, you must be doing this the same, so if you want to do it the other way around, that's fine. If I want to catch with my right and throw with my left, that's fine, but we both have to be doing it. So we're going to do throw with right, catch with left. It looks a bit like this. Throw, we transfer. We go again. Notice we're trying to throw it straight to one another's hand. We're nice and low, good ready positions here. I'm watching the ball that's coming towards me, not the one that I'm throwing, because I should be able to throw without thinking too much about where I'm throwing it. Okay, this is what it's going to look like. What you're going to try and do this time is try and do as many as you can in 30 seconds. Okay, so you can go quite fast if you want to try and get a better score, but you might make more mistakes and waste some time, or you can go a bit slower, slow and methodical. Sometimes the slow one wins the race. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go from there. Right, Scott, you ready for the time? I am ready. We are going to go very quick. We're going to go lightning <laughs> speed. Yeah, well, this is the green challenge. We've got to challenge ourselves, okay? Ready? Three, two, one, go. Okay, I'm going to count. Okay, so we're trying to really focus on the incoming ball. Okay, because this is green, we're trying to go as quickly as we can. We're challenging ourselves with speed and coordination here. This is why we're not moving on this one. We're just really focusing on our ability to catch and send with one hand. We're doing so good, so good so far. <laughs> Let's see if we can keep it up. Laser focus on that incoming ball. Yeah. 
How many did we do? We got 42. I don't Whoa. think I've ever concentrated as hard as I was then Whoa. just to count. <laughs> that was very good. Did you beat us in the comments below? Is the next challenge. Is that right, Joe? That is correct. Very correct. correct. Again, you need your trusty partner. You need two tennis balls each. And again, you're standing yay distance apart. Yay. Now, there are two elements to this. We're doing the same type of throws that we're doing at green, but obviously we have two tennis balls. So when you throw your tennis ball that's in your right hand, you've got to pass the tennis ball that's in your left hand over so you can catch with your left hand. So it should look something like this. This is the first part of it. We're doing it nice and slow. There's like a little conveyor belt of tennis balls always going round in a circle. Not to be confused with the strictly conveyor belt. <laughs> yes, exactly. The caterpillar chap or whatever it would call yeah. it. Um, so that's the first stage, but then we're adding some movement. So we're adding some follow the leader. So I'm going to be the, the leader. Joe has to always follow me. If I'm moving over here, he's got to move over there. If I move over here, he's got to move over here as well. Okay, as we're doing those juggle throws. So let's see if we can put it all together. We're going to start off a bit slow. So you see, I'm making a move over here. Now I'm going over here. <laughs> and you've got to keep those throws going the whole time while he's following me. That's it. Okay, boom, Joe. Great demo. Thank you very That's much. Fantastic. Bumped into a table that time. <laughs> because it's a yellow, really challenge yourself. If you find that easy, okay, speed up the movement, okay, and speed up the throws to challenge yourself. Okay, so on to the 30 second challenge. For this 30 second challenge, we are just seeing if we can do it without any mistakes or as few mistakes as possible. So, I've got the timer at the ready. Joe, are you ready? Yes. He is ready. Um, are you guys at home ready? Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Three. One person. Two. One. Go! Okay. okay. Oh, Joe's one mistake already. Remember, you're following me, Joe. Yeah. So if I go here, that's it. Thank you for reminding me of the rules. I need to stay here for a little bit, maybe. Ooh. And there. Concentrating so much. Oh, I can't go any further that way. Noise is coming from me. There's a ghost in the room. Oh, 30 seconds. God, that was the most nerve wracking 30 seconds we've done on film. I mean, I very rarely make mistakes, and I made the mistake there. Oh my gosh, so we got, yeah, we got one. We got so one hard, just at the start. Okay, let us know if you managed to beat us at home. I hope people did. Often I think we're, we set the barrier too high. Just, Not today. just amazing. Now then, there's nothing left to do except say, I hope you had a really good time everybody, doing every progression from red up to yellow today with our agility coordination special. As always, let us know how you did in the comments below, and if you really enjoyed the session, you can click the link in our bio to buy us a coffee. And we will see you next time on Wednesday. Wednesday. Bye.